I am, I am really gobsmacked to be sitting here. And I think in the year that we've had, I think everyone deserves an award for the work that they've done this year. It's hard when you work sometimes in a less clinical role to feel that you're making a difference to patients and to people. Um, but to know that in some small way, what I was doing to help my teams um, has helped them to provide services to patients and that they felt they could work better when I was here and for having my support, well, that's what it's all about and that's what I'm here for and it's lovely that they have um, nominated me and said the lovely things that they have. It's really humbling and surprising and um, to be nominated by my colleagues. It, it's, it's, I feel very lucky to work with such a great team because we're all pulled together these past six months. It's been challenging but we all pulled together and the fact that they nominated me for, for this award, I'm just, I, ha I don't really have the right words. <laughs> I am absolutely honoured to be nominated um, for this award and I'd like to share and dedicate it to all of our nurses that have been redeployed, moving teams, the stresses that they've experienced. I care about all of the nurses I came into this job because I care about our staff. Um, our mission statement at this hospital uh, we use is care for those that you love the most. Um, that's not just for patients, that is for each other, that is for our staff. I've been here 15 years and that's for my work family. Um, and I genuinely care, which is why it's important for me um, to put the right skills in the right place, gain an understanding of what benefit it will be with our new wards that we've got, how we're gonna move staff. Um, I've worked very closely with our nurse bank team who have been amazing. We've looked at our agency, making sure that we're putting them in the right place and keeping them safe as well. For the last six months now, myself and a number of colleagues were asked to set up a new established hand trauma unit separated from the hospital. Um, this covered orthopaedic and plastic surgery and we've achieved great patient throughput in that time as well as maintaining high levels of care for patients and we've um, got a high level of patient satisfaction from this as well. Very proud moment to be nominated. Um, it's been a great team effort though, everyone's without the team. This wouldn't have worked, this department in the Vanguard unit. Um, so it's been, yeah, everyone's pulled together and, and made it what it is. It was unexpected, um, but I feel really honoured. I, I feel that it's the recognition for the work of the whole team rather than uh, my own nomination. I function uh, I work together with my colleagues and I have been very lucky to work with extraordinary colleagues. So we as a team, we also work very closely with, with our biomedical scientists. It is like one well old machine, really. I was inspired to create my booklet from my foundation degree in health studies as I wanted to provide my patients with something to do while they were in hospital and reduce the boredom factor. The main benefits of my Beat Bed Bound Boredom booklet is to reduce um, patients becoming deconditioned by increasing their activity levels and increasing mental stimulation which can therefore reduce the risk of falls. I am absolutely delighted to be nominated for the Hero Award, it is such a privilege to be recognised.